imagine. One of pride, one of pride that a young man that I was so fortunate and blessed to coach his senior year in college has, has made a dream become a reality. And he set the foundation of my 14 years of Bellarmine of the example, you use basketball, you don't let it use you. He did it academically, he did it athletically, he did it socially, and now he's done it professionally. Where you never let basketball use you. You know, his slogan about where dreams become reality. Well, the discipline, the passion, the dedication that Matt Miller had as a player, this is the result, this is it. This is what's happened because he took that dedication, discipline, attention to detail as a player and he's turned it into a, 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 a reality. Think about this. He has used basketball to help others. What if everybody in our society helped others like Matt Miller is? Oh, I understand the business side of it. But the bottom line is, he's helping others. That's what make, makes for extraordinary people. He's truly extraordinary. You travel all over the nation, been to thousands of different facilities. Where does this kind of fit into all of that? It's class. It's class. I mean, one thing I learned, I learned as a high school player way back, my high school coach taught me that, you know, if you ever get into coaching, he knew I wanted to be a coach. If you provide for him first class, you're more apt to get first class in return. No guarantees. But if you treat him third class, you're going to get third class. And this is truly, truly first class. We try to live that for our players, our locker room, the way we travel, the way we practice to come to a facility like like M14. This is amazing. Like my high school coach often taught me, he said, you know, I keep trying and trying and trying to provide. This is way back in the day. He would sell candy to provide us with a, a blazer, a shirt, a tie, and slacks to wear to a game. We were not very good, but we looked the part just to be first class. And that's where Matt has never cut a corner. There is not one thing, not one inch of this facility that's not top of, the, top of the line. So coach, I can't let you leave here without asking uh, you know, your best Matt Miller story. No, I've got it. Oh, I'm ready. My, I, was, I was at the University of Louisville. I'd worked my entire life to get a position there. I was a walk-on JV player there. I, heard, I worked there under two Hall of Fame coaches and Coach Denny Crum, Coach Rick Patino. Went to the Final Four in St. Louis in 20, 2005. Got beat by the University of Illinois in the semifinal. And I'm named the head coach of Bellarmine. And in my first meeting, I excused the four seniors. I threw them out of the meeting. I made them leave the room. And I know to this day, they all thought, well, my career is over. Well, I took everybody in that room. And I said, I already had a, an assistant. I had a staff. And I said, I don't care what you do as a player, a coach, a manager. I don't care if you have to shoot 500 extra shots a day, draw 10 charges a game, and an assistant coach, watch film till your eyeballs fall out. These four seniors must have a winning year. It's their senior year in college. It must be one of the greatest years of their life. Well, that year we ended up winning, having a winning record, all because of Matt Miller. But I have been so lucky, and when I look back and I followed his career as a, as a husband, a father, a teacher, a professional, it's hard not to get emotional because I'm going to take you into Knights Hall, our home arena, his, the summer before his senior year. At the time, I was starting Bellarmine camps, going to the University of Louisville, uh, fulfill my obligation, do their camps, back to Bellarmine, go back to UofL, close camp, back to Bellarmine to close camp. Matt Miller was doing an internship with Enterprise a Car Rental right by our campus. And he'd work out every morning. Six in the morning, he's in the gym. And I'm there very early because I'm to two different university camps. And I'm so lucky. I mentioned my tenure at the University of Louisville. I've been to four Final Fours at Bellarmine, won a national championship. It's humbling to say I was elected or put in the Kentucky Athletic Hall of Fame. One of the greatest compliments in my life. 
very late that first summer, Matt Miller at the end of a 6 a.m. workout, off to his internship, had never scored a point since I'd been at Bellarmine. We had not played a game. He got real emotional one morning. I mean, he literally was in tears. My assistant was Eric Scott. And Matt says, I said, Matt. And I thought something had happened at home. I, I thought there was something. I said, Matt, are you OK? He said, Coach, I I've never played one second for you yet, but I know this right now. I'd give anything if I could play more than just the one year I'm going to get to play for you. And I'd cry saying it. To see 14 years later, look what he's become. And we hold him on a pedestal for our current players to look at. And, and that, that is the NCAA. And society should take Matt Miller and put him on a pedestal and say, this is how you use athletics. But it, it, it's amazing. And that he's doing it to help the young people in this community. What if everybody in every community reached back and, and tried to make others better? Wow, it, it's frightening. But that, that morning in Knights Hall, I'll never forget, ever, ever. We, we won a game that year at Quincy University. Went double overtime, 103-101. 103-101. He played 50 minutes, never came out of the game. And it was a high possession game. And, and we, we were so bad, we threw him the ball and just said, hey, man, do the best thing you can. We can't. He did not have one single turnover, ever. We had a game on Saturday afternoon, 43 hours later. He tried to play 18 minutes and physically, physically couldn't go. He had given everything he had. And he leads by example here, and he will the rest of his career. He is a superstar. He's going to see this, of course. Is there anything you would like to say to him? Love you. Bellarmine basketball right now in 2019 would not be what it is without Matt Miller, period. No way. No way. No way. Matt, what, what you've done, son, won't be a paycheck I'll ever cash in a bank. They only let you cash them at a bank one time. But the emotional paycheck of coaching you, I can cash that check, that paycheck, that emotional paycheck over and over and over for a lifetime. Thank you. Thanks, Dave. Is that good?